Thomas, welcome to Bromsgrove Sporting. Thank you. Uh, what made you choose Bromsgrove as your uh, manager position? Um, it was just one of those conversations that I had in the um, in the sort of off season. That really, in this league, I had a few offers of this league and above, and I just. You know, it's the whole drive of the club and the fans, really. And I've been fortunate over the years to manage a few big clubs, uh, and they are really the the excitement, the excitement on the day of the game. So it was uh, once um, you know Bromsgrove gave me the opportunity. It was a, it was an easy decision. We've seen quite a few of our old players leave this season. Have you are you happy with the budget that you've been given by the board to then recruit new new players? Uh, over, I'm not much? sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. There's ever a manager that's going to be happy. Mm. Uh, they're always going to. They're always going to want more. But look, I, I know what the um, the parameters I'm working in. You know, players players have, have gone. Of, co of course, they have. You know, for their own reasons. You know, players needed to go. Um, you know, probably it's it's been a difficult place for the last sort of few months or so. Of course, it has. It, it was a tough end to the season. So, you know, players want a new challenge. The club wants a new challenge. Um, and so I think it's probably best for all parties, you know, for people to go off and enjoy their football elsewhere, and, and, and we try and rebuild for the future. What are your kind of main objectives for this season? Do you think that playoffs, promotion, kind of is that what you're looking at, or just to stay safe? Uh, no, I mean my, my aim is to be as to be as high as we can. I, I would ideally like to be in and around the playoffs, uh, certainly come the end of the season. Obviously, we've got a bit of a rebuilding job to do first, which people can see from tonight and over the uh, the last few weeks, and probably the new announcements that will maybe come later in the week. Um, you know, we've, we, it's about how quick they gel. Uh, we've got to work, they've got to work a lot hard in the pre-season to uh, to gel together as a team uh, and then we'll see where it takes us but I think of the the recruitment so far I think I've been quite happy uh, you know I think it's a, a good side um, you know defensively wise here was okay last year you know I suppose if you look at it they only conceded you know not loads lots more goals than teams that got promoted but at the other end of the field wasn't good enough you know so obviously with the likes of Nike and uh, Sweeney and Barnes Homer and, and, and maybe one or two others that we're, we're thinking of uh, will certainly change that and you know we're, we're trying hard and, and like I say it's all about how quickly they gel if they can gel for the first game of the season we'll be we'll be delighted it's a tough league um, you know it's a tough league but I see no reason why we can't compete very very well be confident of bringing back the good times at Bromsbury Sporting? I hope so. I mean, you know, over the years, you know, I, I've managed some good clubs over the years, you know, and I've been fortunate, you know, Ketrin, Tamworth, whatever, and and I wouldn't have been here if I didn't think I could, you know, people, you know, if I didn't think I could do well, and, and it's not just about me, it is about the team, and it is about Steve, it is about Gaz and Ryan and the others, you know, if I didn't think we could do well, we wouldn't be here, you know, the whole aim is to, what we've told the players, the pressure isn't, isn't, on us to be to, to go and win the league. There's some massive teams in this league that um, you know uh, that back the teams financially for a lot more than we do. But we, we've got you know we've got great belief here. And what we will have is great belief, and uh, you know I'm I'm really hopeful that we can turn it around quite quickly. Cheers, Thomas. Good luck. Thank you. See you soon.